we can all agree that this year has been a tough year. But as Newsline reporter Alexa Larson tells us, many people are choosing to focus on the things that they are grateful for as we approach Thanksgiving. It's no secret that 2020 has had a long list of challenges, but despite that, many people are choosing to focus on the things that matter most to them as they celebrate Thanksgiving this year. This Thanksgiving, I am extra grateful for my health. I am also grateful to have a job and have the flexibility to work from home every day. I am grateful for warm temperatures in November. I'm especially grateful for friends and family this Thanksgiving. Grateful for the cutest little girls, Rowie and Elle. I thank her for pizza. This Thanksgiving, I am grateful that I get to work from home. Um, so I can work in my sweats. And I'm also grateful for all the really pretty Utah sunsets lately. I'm grateful for a body and for healthy food to nourish my body. I love reading, so I'm grateful for books. I'm grateful for my dog and my kids and the time I get to spend with them. This time of year, I'm super thankful for my friends and family that live close by and that I have a warm bed to sleep in every night. Recently, I feel so grateful for the sunsets. I feel like every night there's pink cotton candy clouds in the sky and everything's so beautiful. It's like a gift in 2020, kind of a crazy year. This year more than ever, we're reminded of the many things that each of us has to be grateful for. Wishing you and your loved ones a very happy Thanksgiving. I'm Alexa Larson reporting for Newsline Provo. Thanks, Alexa.